Hey guys, I'm out in Shenzhen, China at the moment. Uh, so I've taken this time to put a small video together to teach you how to create a blog in under five minutes in WordPress. Uh, all, all of my businesses uh, are WordPress based. My uh, local SEO business, WordPress. My e-commerce sites run on WordPress. My, my personal blog that you found this on, WordPress. My technical blog. Uh, that I created 10 years ago and started all of this. Um, also WordPress. Uh, it, it's, it's amazingly powerful. Uh, and this is, this is just a short video on getting started with Bluehost um, so that you can build the foundation for hopefully uh, a new prosperous business. Let's get started. So this is Bluehost. Click Get Started Now, and then just select the most popular plus plan. Uh, enter the domain that you want to use for your website into the box, and then click Next. Then here we just enter the usual name, name and address that the account is registered to. Uh, keep the default package as is the best value and comes with backups and all the important stuff. Uh, and we just enter our credit card details here and uh, your VAT registration number if your VAT registered uh, confirm and then click accept and then boom congratulations uh, we don't need any of that so click no thanks click through welcome to Bluehost now we've got to create a password for our account so read the rules Lowercase, uppercase, numbers, and special characters. They're very picky about passwords. And then, boom, log in to your Bluehost dashboard. This is where the magic happens. So, we want to click install WordPress. That will automatically install WordPress for us. Um, just do the normal install at the top. We don't need any of these paid options, they're unnecessary. So just, just click the first install. Uh, choose the domain. Uh, we've only got one. So choose, choose the domain you want WordPress to be installed to. And we'll uh, check the domain just to make sure it's all okay. Uh, expand the uh, advanced options. And accept the terms and conditions. So here we want to enter the site title. So for me, it's London Breast Enhancement. And I want to use my own username, Russ Power. I don't want to use my email address, so I'm going to change that as well. And it gives you, um, it gives you a suggested admin password. I'm going to leave it as a suggested one, as it looks quite secure. And then click Install Now. So Bluehost is now installing WordPress for us. Uh, during this process, we get taken to the Superstore. We can buy custom themes and all sorts. We don't need any of that at the moment. And all we have to do is wait for that green bar along the top uh, to reach 100%. Not sure why it says three installs. Um, we're only installing one WordPress instance for one domain. Um, so let's see what happens at the end. So there's quite cool themes here, $59, it's not a bad price. Same price as Theme Forest. Okay, so the installs are complete. Um, it's showing three, but let's just click the top one, and there we go, londonbreastenhancement.com, with my username and password. So when we view the site, it shows a placeholder. So let's go to admin login. We're only three and a half minutes in, so now we've installed WordPress. So now let's do a base configuration. So log in with the username and password, uh, click Remember Me. And the first thing we're going to do is we're going to just create a WordPress page. So page and posts are very similar. Um, 
technically there's not much of a difference. It's more kind of layout wise, but we're going to create a page that we can use for our front page of the website. So London Breast Enhancement. Welcome to London Breast Enhancement. So we're going to use this as, as the front page. So after we've saved that, we want to go to our permalinks. This is something else I like to do. I like to make my permalink the post name. So settings and permalinks, and then select post name. This is for SEO purposes. It's a good trick. And save changes. Now we're going to pick a theme, so appearance themes. I want a medical theme. I, you know, this is this is a local SEO microsite, London Breast Enhancement. I want I want a medical theme for it. It's taken a little bit of a while to load. All these themes are free in WordPress. They're made by the community, so we don't need to pay that fifty nine dollars. So I typed in medical. So it's, it's almost taking longer to search the themes than it took to actually install WordPress. And here we go, this is one I saw earlier, the healthcare theme. So it looks pretty cool, not bad for the grand sum of zero, zero, zero. So that's looking all right. So we'll click install on that and then boom, we are installing the theme. After it's installed, we want to activate it so we actually use it. And you can see the theme recommends uh, some plugins. So we'll begin installing those plugins. Uh, select all bulk actions, install and apply. This just gives us some extra functionality like Flickr album gallery and Lightbox uh, Instagram, uh, which will be useful. And boom, plugins are all installed. So we're going to make a new post now. Posts are, you know, it's more like a blog, the, the post part. So, you know, some news, site launch, very exciting. Welcome to the new London Breast and Enhancement website. And we're going to add a category for this as it's a post. So this is site news. And publish it. So now we've got a theme, we've got a page, we've got a post, we've set our permalinks to an SEO structure. Now we're going to go to settings and reading and we're going to change the front page to London Breast Enhancement. That's the page we made earlier. So now when visitors visit the website they will see our London Breast Enhancement page at the very front. We'll save those changes, boom, and we'll make the site live at the same time. Now we'll click here to view it. So here we go. Welcome to London Breast Enhancement. You can see on the right under recent posts we've got site launch. The theme's looking pretty good, not bad for two seconds of work. And welcome to London Breast Enhancement is on the front page. So. There's a link under this as well as um, more screenshots to help you follow along. So uh, good luck and happy blogging.